In this Python typings tutorial, I want to talk about optionals. If I define a variable called name and specify its type as a string or none using the union operator and assign a value to it. In such situation, we are saying that the variable called name is actually accepting values of type string or none and nothing other than that. In Python versions below 3.10 for saying the same thing or coding the same thing and specifying its type, you had to use the typing module and import the optional. And instead of using the union operator, you had to actually use the optional and pass the string type type to the optional inside the brackets. Here we are saying assigning the value of a string type to the another underlying name variable is optional. We could either use the union operator str or none or use the typing module and import the optional and pass the type that you want to be optional to it inside the brackets. This way you can actually document the code. For example, I can define a function called greet and pass a variable called name to this greet function. I can also specify the type of this variable to be actually optional. That is, I can either pass a string or none. Depending on the use case of our function, we can decide which variables must be optional and which variables don't have to be. For instance, I have decided that the parameter name that is passed to the function greet over here has to be optional. Now, if I call the function greet, the editor will throw an error saying that I haven't passed any parameter to the greet function because the parameter name has to be passed either as a string or none. For instance, if I pass the none to the greet function, the editor will not throw any kind of error anymore. Of course, I have used the greet function for demonstration purposes. In the real world scenario, it would be much more complex and typings would help you. I can also pass the default value none to the parameter name for the greet function. This way, if I call the greet function, the editor will not throw any kind of error because it simply defaults to none and if I pass a value of type other than none and a string, the editor will throw an error saying that the type of value passed to the function is incompatible with none type and a string type. And if I pass a string, for example, numerist over here or the variable name, the editor will not throw any kind of error because we are simply passing a value of type a string to the function greet. Also, do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel to not lose future content on Python typings for beginners. As always, see you all later.